What if I tell you that the sum of the angle in a triangle is not 180 degree? When we draw an angle on a sheet of paper, the sum of the angles are confined to 180 degrees. But in practical, when we measure the large distance angles on the surface of the earth, then the sum of the angle of that triangle is more than 180 degree. This is spherical geometry. Suppose you want to measure the distance between these two bottles. There are a few different ways you can do it. You can use a measuring tape and start measuring from one bottle to another. As you see, it's a little bit difficult to measure from one bottle to another by just one person. But if we are keeping the measuring tape on the ground, then it will be fairly easy for us to measure the distance between the two. We need a surface on which to measure. It is always easy to have a surface like a ground to measure something. So there are two things. Mainly we need a surface on which to measure and a point, a origin point from where to start the measurement. Let us say that we want to measure our height. For myself, how do I measure my height? I can say I can measure my height with reference to the ground on which I am standing or even I can say that my height is from the sole of my feet. Now can you tell me what will be the height of these mountains from where these mountains are being measured? Are they measured from the immediate ground or from what? So we need a particular surface from which to measure the height also. So we need a surface to measure the distance. We need a point, origin point from where to start the measurement. And also we need a surface from which we can measure the height, right? So you see the earth shape is highly irregular with very high mountains to the deep ocean and flatlands. So how do we measure something on earth? There is one way. We use a gravity model or the differences in the gravity field to create a model of the earth and we call this a geoid. We can say that geoid is a mathematical shape that the ocean water will take if there is no tide or wind under normal gravitational force. If offshore surveying is your thing, then this is the right place you are in. Please subscribe and join my team as a member so that you can have exclusive access to all of my videos.